Hello, my name is Guzel. I'm from Russia. Will you hate me? Welcome back to another episode of channel How to Germany where we delve into cultural difference and life in Germany, of course. Today we're exploring a captivating topic. Let's go. I know Russians have gotten themselves really bad reputation here, not only in Germany, everywhere. And I really understand this. Sometimes people ask me, do I feel something here in Germany? What people think about me? Uh, do you feel discrimination or something like this because I'm Russian? Honestly, about politics uh, in Germany, they always say that we should to understand difference between uh, politics, between country and between people. But Russia and Russian are not the same. But today we will speak about people and we will speak about my personal experience. These are my experience, no generalizations. It's only about me. Let's go. Sorry for this quality of video because uh, I had... Um, I'm already living in Germany three years, but I have this time in Germany. Now it's November. And of course, it's dark, it's raining, it's horrible, and it's depressing. I think it's the best weather for this, for my YouTube video. Honestly, most people, they don't care too much whether you are Russian or not. Eastern people from East part of Europe, it's likely how they will see you. Ironically, at least for me, it didn't feel like racism or something else towards Russia and Greece after the war. I assume it's because people can't even understand the difference, they even can't recognize are you from Russia or are you from Ukraine or from another country, for example, Belarus or the Poland. In everyday life, honestly, you, they can't see big difference between people. I mean, even if you speak Russian, in a train, how should they know that you're from Russia and you're not from Ukraine anyway? So this whole confusion is that helps here. It doesn't mean that it doesn't exist. I just say how it's felt for me. Yes, I'm not discriminated sometimes. I maybe look strangely when I speak Russian aloud in public, but then maybe it's more because people are interested in me or maybe I really speak very loud. But um, honestly, I can say from my experience, yes, we have more problem with opening bank accounts or sizing contracts, for example, flat contract. Yes, we have problem. Due to sanctions, my Russian citizenship might be viewed as risk. A lot of people have problems really with bank accounts, even those who live here for several years. It's really super crazy. Bank really can don't open account for you. It's crazy. Honestly, Germany has a huge Russian population. Many of them are German-Russian, that they're German from blood from DNA, but they live in Russia many, many generations and they return to, to the, and they return to Germany, maybe 20 years ago, maybe 10 years ago. As long as I can speak German, I can understand everything, my German skills are very, very good. I think so, <laughs> better than my English, sorry. Most people, they don't care where you're from. And anyway, big cities, uh, especially university cities, they're super international. Okay, you can see a lot of a lot of international people. That's why they really don't care where you're from. I'm from Russia. I guess it's I can also it depends. You will meet here, you can meet here those and those people. I also guess that some will be open, friendly, and few will not. <laughs> Sorry. Problems will arise, as I mentioned before, when people are really discriminated, when they try to open bank account or sign contract, for example, flat contract. Truly, really sometimes people are the victim of country politics. Uh, and, but some people, for example, here, they can't understand difference between politics and between people. 
I love Germany. I live here three years. Going to another country is always a great experience, despite the crazy time. Thank you. Uh, thank you for watching my video. Uh, really interesting. Uh, what do you think about this station? Uh, I will read all comments. Bye-bye.